Happy New Year! That's easy, isn't it? Time just keeps doing that. It is now Sunday, the 1st of January. Welcome to another episode of... Toby Stupid Vlog! Happy New Year. That should be how I start this vlog. Um, yeah, welcome... <laughs> Happy New Year, welcome to the rubbish. Um, yes, we're just going out to do some shopping. Uh, because it's massively overdue and uh, got nothing to eat. That's what's happening now. Anyway, welcome to New Year. Um, let's see if things are different. <laughs> you never know. Anything could happen. The wonders of Canary Wharf. Looking for the DLR. Looking for the other DLR station. Concrete jungle that is the <laughs> Jubilee line. Greenwich. Home of mobile shops and Waterstones and Ben and Jerry's. I was here, when was I here? With Matt in April, May. It looks like a house of guys. And it was really miserable weather. In fact, it was probably more miserable than it is now on January the 2nd. Fan museum. Amazing. Let's go straight on. There's the Cutty Sark. Looking a lot better with the Christmas tree on the top. Greenwich Hill by the observatory. The dog's gone slightly mental chasing the ball. That's the observatory. Oh, well, that's the observatory. That's a clear day. This is Greenwich Village, I guess, in the non-American sense, in the London sense. So this is shopping under Canary Wharf. You can tell that because there's really big skyscrapers everywhere. There's three different shopping malls joined together, so we have this map. <laughs> we just have to work out where to get to the other one. loosely. It's the first day back at work properly. We've had gale force winds and I mean look it's fucking dark. <laughs> what the hell is this all about? Uh, I now remember why animals hibernate this time of year. It's because it's rubbish. It was nice yesterday to be fair but this I'm not, I'm not doing this. This is rubbish. Anyway I'll see you in, ah oh, yes I know what I'm going to show you. In moments from now, and only one short tube ride away from me, um, is the brand new Global Reception. How exciting, you may say. Well, I hope so, because they've spent bloody long enough doing it, so let's go and see what it looks like. Hello, good morning. Like your new desk. Beautiful. Love what you've done with the place. Oh, I still got the same perception though. 
So this is the Global Theatre. Nice little theatre. Um, I don't know why we're watching BBC News. Better not do that. It's copyright. Um, uh, yeah, so there we go. You can do little presentations in here to a nice big screen, controlled as always by iPad. This very red room, as you might have guessed from the backwards logos, is the heart room. That says heart there, you see. And again, massive television, nice red chairs. Haven't sat in them yet. Uh, controlled in here by iPod Touch, um, which presumably, there you go, like so. And that is how the brand rooms work. There's actually one of these for each major brand. So there's a capital room, and next room, and a classic room as well as the theatre. And an LBC room, obviously. And there you can book them all on these little touch pads here so you can pick a time and then book a meeting. There's a lot of buttons here. Very high tech. That's how we roll. And that's what's seen all the way down this corridor that goes back to reception. So there's Neil, he's currently on air in the studio. Yeah, well the plan was that I was just going <laughs> to... The plan was I was just going to line you up against this wall and shoot you. Um, in, <laughs> in a manner that Jeremy Clarkson would be incredibly proud of. So, you ready? i got five people here with guns and... Check out that. That is this morning's sunrise. It's purple and orange and scary. Which is lovely, but at least it's not cold and shit. Speaking of shit, he's having a bad day. Anyway, off to work we go, like the dwarves said. Let's look at Lindsay's ridiculous shoes. Martin's gel. Martin actually looks shorter. Maybe it's just the angle. <laughs> Wall like a lady. <laughs> so it's the 6th of Jan, so we've got to take the tree down. Which we've largely de-decorated and then it folds up and goes in a box. That's going to be, I should imagine, some sort of wrestling match. Man versus tree. I should imagine tree will win. Oh, that's where the missing ball is. Brilliant. Yes, every other decoration is nearly down by this behemoth. Hello, it's me from the future. You can tell I'm from the future because my hair's got totally out of control. Anyway, I just thought I'd come back in time to introduce this little montage. So this is 52 weeks of 2011 in 52 seconds. So I hope you enjoy.